everybody, this is Larry Trexer with Sim Products, and today we're going to talk a little bit about a tech tip involving the Sim Orbit tip. Now, as we mentioned before in our Orbit video, we talked a little bit about the fact that we want to put, using the Orbit tip, we want to put that down on top of a primer, not directly to bare metal. And with that, we want to talk a little bit about how, you know, functionally seam sealing a seal and cosmetically seam sealing a seal. And so we're gonna talk, and I wanted to make sure we just go through that so that everybody understands what we're talking about. Now you have two options when we talk about functionally and cosmetically sealing. The first option is, is to lay a bead of seam sealer down here, and then if you wanted to remotely make a bead off to the side, now I've done this one earlier, and I'm showing this on top of regular masking tape, but usually it works better if you could use it on boxing tape. But you can peel this up after it's dry. You can scuff the back side of it, make sure that you blow it off. And then on top of that wet bed of seam sealer, you can come back and then basically glue the orbit bead right down on top of it. So that is one way of doing this if you wanted to make it remotely. If you want to make it while it's on the vehicle, then that's also easy to do. So we're gonna take our gray heavy bodied seam sealer and what we're gonna do is we're just gonna lay a small bead of, of seam sealer down into this seam and just like caulking a bathtub at home, we're gonna take our finger and just basically come back. You can use a spreader, you can do whatever you want, but you just wanna take just enough to put in there and seal that seam off. And then once you're done with that, we can actually just take, put the, the orbit bead uh, tip right on top of, it, uh, of this tip and then you can lay it right on top of each other, wet on wet. So I'm gonna show you how that works. Now, with this cartridge, I've already equalized it and I've already purged it, so we're in good shape there. So, we just need a tiny little bead doesn't take a lot and then you can come in here you can spread that and basically all you're doing is using it to seal up that seam you don't need a lot of product here as a matter of fact if you're using a manual applicator sometimes it works even better just to put down just a small amount of product now we know that we have functionally seamed that seal now we're gonna come back with the orbit bead and you can use it two different ways. You can use it on the flat side or you can use it with the guide. And in this case, because I actually have a little bit of a flange there, I can actually use it with the guide. And then we're just gonna come in and put that ripple bead right on top of it. And if you slow it down, it gets wider. If you speed it up, it gets smaller. And that is how you functionally and cosmetically seal a seam using Orbit. 